I, you know, I, I've been in the water with sharks before, and, and you know, some bigger, some smaller than the sharks we saw out in Hawaii. So it was, it was cool. It's always cool to see sharks up close. Um, you know, I'm getting more and more comfortable being in the water with sharks, and I think the next time, you know, we'd probably do it without a cage. I just don't think you have much to worry don't about. Don't let your arm or leg go in between the cage and the boat. Be careful getting in and out. So this is how you do it. You have your mask set before you go over the side, and we're gonna help you with that. Hold both sides of the gateway, use this inside step, left foot, right foot, switch your hands, and then right down the ladder. Hold any bar in the cage. Those inside bars feel pretty good. Um, just don't reach out past the bar. But find the bottom one so you know you can stand up, and we know you can stand up anytime you need to in the water. If the sharks come through the two big gaps in the side, just everybody hold your hands up together. Should keep them coming in this time. I would. <laughs> the first day in Oahu was pretty exhilarating because uh, the captain actually let me and the executive producer get into the, the cage with the sharks. And it was really cool. I've never experienced that before. I've done a shark dive before with bull sharks, but this was unlike anything, um, being in the cage, I did feel safe, but at the same time you still feel vulnerable and um, it was definitely a cool experience. I definitely feel for the underwater photographers though that we hired that was they were just free swimming with, you know, 10 to 15 sharks surrounding them. I, I think that's amazing. So I'd never seen that many sharks in my life. Um, we were in Hawaii, and we went out with a cage diving company where they let guests get into a cage, and they always see sharks. And it was crazy because we had a guy from Australia, Tony. He was filming underwater, just swimming around with his scuba gear with a school of sharks. And uh, I'm on the follow boat, and we're filming them doing this and seeing the sharks. and. You know, all of a sudden, the guy that's the skipper on our boat's like, I'm gonna take a dive in. And I'm like, are you serious? And he's like, yeah, and I had a, I had a GoPro on a pole cam that I was using, and I'm like, will you take this with you? And he's like, sure. So he just jumps in with just scu scuba gear, not even a tank or anything, just goes and swims with the sharks. <laughs> and that, <laughs> I was like, are you sure? So they told us in Hawaii that they only let people swim with them out in the open after they've been in the cage a few times because the shark sensory can tell if your heart rate goes up or although they'll know if you're nervous. So they make you get calm with them first before you can swim in open water. Well, that was one of the coolest things I've ever how, done. So how many, how many you think are down there? There's a good 15. I mean, for all the ones you guys saw up here, they were just sort of stacked down, down to the bottom into the abyss. It was amazing.